Rising Tensions in the Horn of Africa, The Power Struggle of Ethiopia, Egypt and Somalia. Hello and welcome. This is Newsfest Addis, your daily source of news bites, locally, regionally and internationally. The Horn of Africa is at a crossroads as Ethiopia, Egypt and Somalia find themselves increasingly embroiled in conflicts over water resources, territorial sovereignty and regional influence. With the stakes high, regional rivers and global interests have converged, making this volatile region a flashpoint for future conflicts. Ethiopia, Egypt and Somalia, a region on each. Recent events have brought the long-standing tensions between these three nations into sharper focus. Ethiopia's ambitious plans for maritime access and water management have collided with interests of both Egypt and Somalia drawing in external powers and complicating the path to peace. One of the central flashpoints is Ethiopia's deal with Somaliland, a self-declared independent region of Somalia. Signed in January, this agreement grants Ethiopia access to the sea by passing Somalia's control. The move has sparked diplomatic friction, with Somalia's president Hassan Sheikh Mohammed accusing Ethiopia of undermining Somalia's sovereignty. This despite has only escalated after Turkish brokered talks between the two nations ended in failure. The regional power struggle has drawn the attention of major global players. Turkey, the United States and Gulf of states like the UAE, Saudi Arabia and Qatar have all sought to secure their interests in the region. In February, Turkey solidified its presence in Somalia with a 10-year agreement amid a blustering maritime security. The U.S. followed suit with plans to establish several military bases in Somalia to strengthen its national army. Meanwhile, Egypt has deepened its involvement by signing a new defense pact with Somalia, signaling a border alignment against Ethiopia's regional ambitions. This military agreement underscore the growing militarization of the region, where foreign nations see opportunities to expand their influence and the distinctions. Egypt's involvement, in particular, is seen through the links of its long-standing Nile water despite with Ethiopia, which has now spilled into the Horn of Africa's border security dynamics. The Nile despite and the Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dump at the heart of Ethiopia and Egypt's strained relations is the construction of the Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dump, which Ethiopia views as a critical project for its development. For Egypt, however, the dam represents a direct threat to its water security, as over 95% of its population depends on Nile, as over 95% of its population depends on the Nile, with the majority of the river's water originating from Ethiopia's highlands. Egypt's concern is that the dam could reduce its water supply, geoparadising agriculture and livelihoods. Ethiopia, with its rapidly growing population and pressing needs for electric city, considers the Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam a matter of national pride and sovereignty. As the dam nears completion, the Nile has become a symbol of both opportunity and conflict in the region. Somalia's sovereignty at risk. For Somalia, the port deal between Ethiopia and Somaliland is not just an economic matter, but a question of national integrity. Somaliland's 30-year quest for independence have never been recognized by Somalia, and Ethiopia's engagement was the breakaway region to legitimize its sessions. Somalia sees the deal encroachment on its territorial sovereignty, rising fears of further fragment, further fragmentation. The port access that Ethiopia seeks is more than just logistical. It reflects a border strategic need. Landlocked since the 1990s, Ethiopia's push for maritime access is tied to its vision of economic growth and greater autonomy. Yet, for Somalia, the issue strikes at the heart of its struggle to maintain a unified state and its internal and external challenges. A region entangled in rivers and competing interests. As the Horn of Africa becomes a chessboard for regional and global powers, the legislative needs and fears of Ethiopia, 
Egypt and Somalia risks being overshadowed by external interference, while collaboration could unlock economic opportunities and regional stability. The current trajectory leans more towards rivalry and conflict. The interwind despites over ports, water, and sovereignty have created a complex landscape where cooperation remains elusive. Only through sustained dialogue and mutual respect can this nation's hope to find a path toward stability in one of the world's most strategically vetted regions. This was our news analysis for today. Stay tuned for more insights as the situation in the Horn of Africa continues to evolve.